Greetings and welcome back to Little Big Workshop. I'm Catherine of Sky and I ran the simulation just a bit so that we have these trample cars ready for shipping. Uh, and then the snow bobs are also much, much further ahead. Hopefully um, that will that will work in our favor. Anyway, I've been giving some thought to expanding the factory, possibly. We have a ton of cash right now and it might just be what we need to kind of get big orders done and maybe uh, get some other things organized. I really want to get more of these truck um, truck stations so that we have an area where we can send off products and uh, also receive them in more quickly. There we go. Let's go ahead and get those things out. Now, somebody mentioned a really interesting thing, and I also found something really interesting from the pop-up tips that come up whenever you load a game. They said that the only things that don't cause obstructions are shelves. I found this very, very interesting um, because we've been putting shelves kind of in the background usually, but they should be on the edge if they don't want, if we don't want them to cause an obstruction. As you see, these things on the floor are causing this red zone right around them. Even though they're within the, um, the tape there, the caution tape, apparently people are worried about stepping on them. So our best bet is actually to put the shelves out there in that area instead of uh, the products there. So we might think about rearranging these things once we set those snow bobs, uh, once we finish those up. So one thing I do want to check is I want to see if we do a regular uh, product from the market and see if it gives us any XP because I don't know if it does or not, to be honest, I have no clue. Um, I have not really observed this um, and it's kind of silly, but uh -huh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna test it out and check it out uh, and it should be fine. So let's see here, we want to get, uh, these are 331, we can easily complete them within two cycles and they're, the price is high for all of these. So let's plan this product here to get the whack -a pins going um 23 sure let's just do that and all the things all the stuff uh yeah sure go and those materials should be arriving just in time for the snow bobs to be shipped right off so let's see these we have five, five nine six three nine five amount of uh xp Jeez. Uh, let's see if that changes with the snow bob sales or delivery, I guess. Okay, come on, let's go. Deliver. Five nine six three nine five. We're gonna drive off, hopefully. All right, we got a ton of XP for that. That is nice. So now this stuff, hopefully, we'll get some of these guys going. I don't know if we. I don't remember if we batched these or not. Jeez. Okay. Oh, hey. We're going to get a real challenge from these people. Nice. I'm excited about this. 21 units, $92,000. Oof. That looks nice. Okay. So we got stuff going on. We got all the things, all the stuffs. Everything is good. Wow. Okay. Let's get, how's this? Is that hard? Let's see, that's 226. Holy fuzzy cats. 247. <laughs> yeah, nope. Mm -mm. Let's do this instead. Jeez, okay. Well then, there's a lot of things to this thingy majingy here. Let's see, what's this? It's gonna be poured stuffs. Wait, maybe we should go for green there instead. Let's see. Is there one that has higher green? Three to five? Nope, there is not. Um, we've already met the targets on the blue. So yeah, just go go for this. All right, sure. Sure, why not? Let's see about this one. Go for green. Yeah, there we go. Good, good, good. And let's see. Five to seven, one to three. How is this? That's just extruded. Sure. What's this? Go for this. The lightness thing. Sewing. Sure. Seven to nine. We'll take it. One to three. Okay. Poured this time. All right. So we need 
some materials that are going to give us some more of that green. What is the green again? Style. Oh, wow. We need style points. Mm -hmm. Apparently these are all the same styles. So we don't actually care. <laughs> this will do it though for us getting a little bit of different metal in here. We can take this one also just guaranteeing us uh, the other thing. Let's see, we're at 36. Sure. Just use the cheaper ones for all of these raw rubber. That's a new material. I don't think I've seen that one before. Okay, let's take this one. There we are. Okay, and we're finalized. Somebody said that what they did is they double clicked this whole thing. Uh, and that, well, that's kind of funky. Let's Red, red is faster, someone said. Mm -hmm. Anyway, they double clicked the entire thing to light up all the icons and then they started assigning. I think it's an interesting idea if this works. Um, yeah, let's try this. Okay, there's that one. And we're gonna batch this. Oh, I bet I didn't batch the other one. All right, um, I guess we'll click the next one. Sure. Da -de -de -de. Yes, there we go. This one, lots of molding going on here. Very nice. And we have this and extruding. Yeah, I guess this works really well. I didn't uh, didn't really think of it this way. I guess I thought I had to click them all the time or something. Anyway, this works really well. Uh, right. So here we have the things and the stuffs and profit of 85,000. <gasps> the meow is so tasty and real. It is unreal how meowy and tasty it is. These probably are being not batched. So life is really worse for the whack -a pin over here. Okay, those are getting fixed. Let's put on our uh, machine uh, looky outy thingy majingy thing. There we go. Radar. We'll get all those things done. So that's nice. These things should hopefully get sorted. Let's see where, where the processes are right now. Looks like we're retooling these machines here and um oh it is doing stuff on two different workstations so that's good oh, they got tired <laughs> are the machines tired or the people tired it's hard to tell <laughs> oh boy oh boy huh okay well before it expires for today i do want to ship off as many as possible and see if we get any kind of points for that and just look we're at 1900 hours um, or 19 o'clock or 19 something, depending on what your proclivities are. Hmm. All right, let's check the numbers here. We have 612595. Try to remember that. My brain ram is not good, um, but we're going to do our best. So let's deliver these 612. Yeah, we did. We got points for this just for clicking the button, I guess. 612, we got 6,000 points just for sending those off right then. Nice. Okay, what was that ding sound? Uh, I don't know, I don't know. So, um, someone else mentioned to me that we might uh, change the priority of these work zones or these, these kind of zones, and I'm not seeing how to do that, to be honest. I thought you could move or resize, general storage, Workstation input, export zone. I think you can only change the priority of the workstations themselves. I don't think you can change the zone priority. Um, so I'm guessing <laughs> you haven't played the game, maybe. <laughs> uh, you can change the workstation priority, though. Those are sliders right here. But yeah, right clicking these doesn't. Oh, these have a priority. Hey, so it looks like those have priority. This one doesn't. So only the yellow zones will have priority, looks like it. But I don't think I want to change any of those because otherwise people are going to be dropping them all in the wrong places, I think. But no, you can't. it looks like you can't for um, the output zones and such. Okay. Hopefully we're going to get ahead on this bike a little bit. Let's go ahead and send these off as well. Deliver these. Yep. And more XP. We should be continually doing this since we're getting XP for this. Um... I think we're going to leave that project though for now until we actually get, wait, did we already sell all we can? Yes, we did. Oh no. We could try to do a medium item. Man, there are like none that are, oh, 
A snow bomb. Hello. We could do this. And this. Wow, tall drawers. We could do these things. And if we want to do the saturate two things at once thing, that could be a bit fun. What we could do is we could get something that has a very low demand and then saturate the market for that, like a kitchen multi-tool or something. Pick that one and pick something else that's quite easy. Maybe this. Wow, 54 units. That is not easy. No. <laughs> uh, the snow bob could be fairly profitable. Just looking at the number of units needed. Why are those in red? Red seems like very small amounts of units or something like that. There's no X though on this. Let's plan these guys. Let's plan this. And we're gonna like do double the amount of thingies here. So I wanna I wanna see, do we have these? I bet these are properly lined up, I'm thinking. So if we make like, I don't know, 40 of these or something, we'll batch them. Yeah. Okay, so there's that. So that was those. Now then, the kitchen multi-tool is also very low demand at the moment, and it is I don't know if it's going to be profitable, but we'll get the achievement, which is all we need to move up in our ranking. So let's get this. Oh boy, oh boy, that's scary. Right. Hey. <laughs> nice. Okay. We need one point on this. We need three points on that. Eh. Okay. Fine. How about that? Okay. Sure. Take again the four. Yes, good. Okay, not too bad. And again, we'll choose these materials. We only need to choose, okay, yellow. Someone got annoyed with me for not you choosing enough colors. So we'll try to use different colors here um, within our thingy. Okay, blue and yellow, we'll have it. Thank you. And a material here, yay. Click all. Right click and assign. And this one, assign. This one and assign. Okay. Boom. Go. Okay, good. Uh, we want to make how many of these things? We want to make several. We need 20. So let's make 40. And what we want to do is we want to sell them all on the same day. Basically completely saturating the market. So we just need a bit of shelf space and we should be fine. Okay, so we have these things, these thingamajingies going on right now. Good. We have this export zone as well. And all these things should be working, I hope, very, very well. But we'll see. We want to definitely get these mountain bikes done and that will give us a lot of uh, points. I'm almost thinking that the regular contracts are probably more XP than the, um, what do you call it? Than the major, major projects for the clients. Oh, wow, stuff. No, too many things. Aye. Okay, so we're going to have an emergency. You know what? We're going to put two shelves here or more maybe okay let's put those there and then we'll put a zone in here order these and we'll get a yellow zone in here hello and we has have zony thingy there we go yay oh boy that's that's a big zone okay excellent but hopefully we'll get some of these things done as we're getting those mountain bikes completed. Look at them. They look beautiful. Aren't they nice? Red for fast. There we go. Very nice. Okay, somebody's complaining. My trucker is stressed. Oh, trucker unhappy. Trucker unhappy. Ay, ay. No, 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 no. Oh, landing everywhere. That's not ideal. It's okay, though. We'll hopefully retrieve it. Hey, this trucker. Oh, no, he was blocking the other truck from coming in. That's a shame. Dang it. Okay, it's fine, though. It, it'll be fine. 
Okay, so all we need to do is save these items until they're all ready and then we flood the market. And that means we can have our little achievement thingy, which I don't really care about it, but yeah, it's kind of needed. So simultaneously saturate the market for two medium or advanced products. I hope I'm reading this right. Basically what that means to me is the demand in the market is met here uh, for both of the things at the same time, the fireplace and the kitchen multi-tool. Wow, we have things here. Many, many challenges to go off of if we want to. Looking pretty good. Uh, I wonder if I should hire another person. We could. There's no reason why not to. I think, well, these people can also be promoted to different specialists. I'm not sure we need, um, could have another, I kind of want to have plastic specialists, but we don't have any more. Let's hire another. <gasps> no, that's it. No more people. No. We really need to get more, um, the, the, the whatchamacallit. No, no, that's not the right one. Okay, the slip and fall thing. Somebody mentioned this in the comments. Thank you very much for that. Uh, sometimes they fall on the ground and the box slips out of their hands and it makes a mess in the hallways and stuff like that. So that's not really desirable. Let's see. This is refresh and renew all general market. No, I want the one where it gives us... Let's see. Oh, that's so nice. Maybe it's this one. Yeah. Maximum workers, 50. Ugh, we need three skill points for that, and we don't have them. But we will soon. We're going to get ahead on this one, and we're starting to work on the fireplace and the multi-tool. Um, and someone looked at the Discord for a little big workshop. Really appreciate that, uh, by the way. Because when I mention things when I'm recording, <laughs> it's so weird because I always forget what happens at the, like, I, I don't remember what I've talked about because I'm just doing so many things at the same time. So I really appreciate it when um, someone goes and, and actually asks in Discord or something like that because I forget the questions. But anyway, somebody went to the Discord and found out that the workstations do not ask for specific people like specialists to operate them. Uh, so that is worth knowing, I think. Um, but apparently the devs are going to fix this uh, in future uh, versions uh, so, or in a future patch or something so I think that's that's a good thing because I would really like to see them prioritize the right person <laughs> you know what I mean that would be good um, but for now you don't have to but they're specialists they do the things and the stuffs um, and I don't think it oh come on fix this thing come on make the thing will ya go there you go deliver all right excellent Okay, so these two things are getting done as well. Really happy about this process going on. Um, it looks like all the things are fine. What about these machines? Eh, they're not quite down to... Let's fix one at a time, maybe. Get that going. Oh, tasty. <gasps> More skill points. Oh my god, the skill points. Hooray. I think we need more peeps. Do we? What do you think? Peeps? We need peeps. Inexperienced intern. Hmm. That seems tasty. Ah, let's take this. We'll take free help. Why not? <laughs> All right, let's go and open the market on this one. Did we? No, we don't have them yet. But next, next cycle, we will have that ready. So maybe we're going to get, oh my God, the break points are going down. We need to get more break rooms, I think. I think it, look at our money. Oh my God, 266,000 monies. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. What I'm thinking would be nice to get more. Oh my God, look at this. There's a big plot over here. We could have more truck bays over here. What I'm thinking is we could put the finished product stuff in this area or something. Um, and like leave this area for all the, uh, first processes and then completely move assembly down here. That's what I'm thinking. That seems really cool. Uh, let's see. We have this area, this one with the calculator. Let's go ahead and buy this plot. Yes. There's no reason not to buy plots because we have mountains of money right now. 
The only reason not to get something is because of too much extra space, I think. I know that doesn't sound like a problem, but okay, can I get out of this view? Go away, shoot. Oh, there we go. Whew. I was like trying to zoom in and I'm like, what the heck? Was not zooming. So yeah. Now then, um, we are having a lack of break rooms. That's not ideal. So what I'm going to do, I think I might just build one big room somewhere. I could calculate this size here though. I think that would be very useful, in fact, to calculate that size. So this is, oh, right, this is a really weird kind of thing. I'm wondering if I should put like one loading bay or one thing out here. Let's see, if I get the wall, it has to be this far away approximately. So that's there. If I just do like this, let's mark that wall. And I want to delete this wall because that's, no, 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 that's really not what I wanted to do. Thanks. No, 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 can't, just, just cancel it. It's fine. <laughs> Let's see if this aligns anywhere. This aligns on this area here or something, I think, right between those two graph lines. Construction tool. So I think if we do a, like that, that's the line that we want to have here. Uh, and how long is this? This is, okay, within the thing it is four and a half meters. Okay. So if we calculate this to say nine meters, this is nine meters. That's the length of two truck stops, we think. We hope we'll give it an, a little extra room perhaps. Um, but I think it would be nice to start off maybe like this and just give ourselves some space here and start off like that. Okay, there we go. That is very, very nice. And tree, get out of the way. <laughs> Don't you trees, no. <laughs> This is rough times here. Okay, maybe it's better just to not run into the fence. It's better to probably do this sort of thing. Oh boy, that's not ideal. Hello. That's a very weird wall right now. Hmm. I don't know if I'm in favor of this wall here. It's looking very strange. Maybe we'll just align it to this wall and call that good. Yeah. That's probably better. Okay, construction tool, there we go. And we'll we'll get the other length on the other side then. Right, so what we can do is delete these bits. Okay, looking nice so far. Nice, nice, good, good. Okay, so. This one can probably go away, these two lines. So we don't need them there. I don't know why it deletes this, these parts too, because it's part of the other wall, I thought. Unless it isn't, I don't know. All right, fill that in again. And the first thing I think I wanna do here is we might want to create um, a break room here. Though somebody mentioned having like break hallways. <laughs> I thought that was a m most interesting suggestion. That was quite funky. Let's see, this break room is quite big. They don't need to be big though. And in fact, they're not that useful when they're really, really big, I think. But if we do something like this, that might give us a nice little, I don't know, area for stuff. Um, we could do a pass through break room as well, where there's stuff on both sides and they can cut, oh, that was not ideal. Pass through on both sides, and then they can just walk through as like a hallway, almost. Uh, that should be enough, maybe. Okay, and let's do the doors. Doors are gonna be, let's see, this way. 
Yes. And then we want door over here. Get this aligned as best as we can. Okay, there we are. Nice. Does that work for us? I'm not quite sure. Maybe we should align this with this hallway instead. We could move this one here and change this a bit. Because I don't want them to have... I want them to be able to go straight through if they want to. Let's move the construction here. Let We can also count. Let's see, these are one, two, three, and four. So from here, we want to go... See, here's one, two, three, and four, and then here. I think that's good. Let's delete this part. Whack a gnome. I that was not what I wanted to do today. But it's okay. We're just doing the things while we're having stuff going on. It's good. It's nice to be able to do this stuff uh, while we're waiting for the other things to start. Okay, good. So that's going to be cutting off a little bit there, but that's okay. We could make this narrower, and I think that's probably a good idea. Um, yeah, construction tool. So we have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. I think it might be worth doing to do that instead. Let's see if we can delete this part. Yes, it wants to delete the whole thing. Thank you, thing. No. No, I... Game. <sighs> Why you do, man? Why did you gotta do that? Why, you stupid thing? No. 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 Ah. Uh... That makes me so sad, man. That really makes me sad. That's just, that's just really not nice thing. I wish there was an undo button. That is so dumb that all of this work is now completely wasted. Jeez, game. Okay, I'll do the whack a gnome and, and then we'll, um, yeah. All right, let's wait for this thing to get out of the way so we can do our planning again. And I'll just try to zip zap this so you don't have to wait. Okay, I think we're ready to click the order button. I have basically created two different break rooms uh, because I realized that the one would be really large and we could get better value with break points if we did two here. It seems like a natural passageway as well. So I created this as its own smaller room. Um, and then this is again, a smaller room. This, look at this large room and huge room. This is interesting that it has both of those modifiers, uh, but maybe that's because it's not finished yet. Uh, in any case, looks like the, um, the items are not yet finished. Uh, so we'll have to, to, um, yeah, wait for those to be done, but man, we're getting stuff going. Look at these kitchen multi-tool. That looks kind of scary. Um, yeah, <laughs> look at how crazy that looks, man. Okay. It is fine. These guys, these guys can be sold. So let's deliver these and then we'll deliver both of the others, um, once they're finished. And I hope that is soon because I would really like to get those going. Do we have enough here? There want 33 units. Wow. We may need to make more of those. These, uh, they want 19 and the, it's going down. It is going down, so let's make sure, that, you know what, let's go up, move those up and see if we can get those going. Let's see, this needs to be fixed. Uh, yep, order, sure. Did I construct something? Uh, I don't recall doing that, but okay, yeah, let's do it. Okay, folks, can we get these guys done? How many are needed right now? 33 units. We have to have 33 to saturate in this cycle. I don't know if we can make it to 33. We might even have some of these portable fireplaces left over, which is not good, but uh, it'll be fine. We'll, we'll get it. Okay. We're getting some of these done. This feels pretty good to get them finished. Uh, need to fix those assembly stations. We need to have a massive assembly room, I think. Okay, those are finished. Nope. 
market cycle is ending. I'm wondering if I should sell some of these because it's less and less each cycle and we have 19 currently. Mm, yeah, we can sell them during the next two. It's fine. It's just fine. Okay, but we might have to start building some more of these. Let's go ahead and... Because those are... Let's see. Oh no, they're going to stay about the same. Okay, that's just fine. Hey, we'll be able to do it very shortly. This is good. Okay. Um, challenges. Anything good in here? We do need to keep up doing our... I don't know, the XP gain thing. Um, but I feel like if we do a lot of the other stuff... Okay, 5-5, five, five, level 5. Yeah. Yeah, this, these we need to get more of Inco Ink. But I feel like if we do more of the regular projects, we're going to get so much more XP and go on the skill tree higher and higher and get things easy, easier for ourselves. Yep, this is going well. All right, so next market cycle. We didn't finish these. How many are demanded of the kitchen multi-tool? 34 units. So we're going to have enough. We are going to have enough which is great. These guys are only 16 units demanded. We could wait for the last cycle, actually. Um, these are going to be probably not above 40, so we can wait on those, actually, and uh, leave those. Whoa, look at this. The zone is, like, completely filled up here. It's going to put a bit of a stress on our system, but we might as well just start the next thing and just wait for those to happen. Okay, let's do the challenges. I want to get these going just because they generate XP with the clients. So yeah, create plan. Let's do this. I think we're all done. Yay. These are the ones we've had before. Okay, good. Execute the plan. Oh, yes. Though we don't really need to wait for these, do we? Because we have more money than we know what to do with at the moment. So yeah, there's that. Okay. One thing I did not take into account is how we're getting in from these truck uh, zones here. So that might be a problem. Let's set up these break rooms, though. We definitely want to do that. So we'll start with probably this. Sure. Let's see, what is this one looking like? Okay, very nice. And next items, foosball. Yeah, I wasn't really sure what else to put here. Let's see, workstation stats. Yeah, this is good. Video games are always nice. And then we'll put in something else. What else? Radio station. This is good. Four for foosball tables. It uh, It sort of fits, but you can't actually play it. <laughs> TV though. We'll put a TV in here. Why not? That's fine. TV gives us four points. I'm not really sure why they have these multiple things. It's like four coffee and four cups. But maybe these, I think these may help recharge stuff. Anyway, let's order these and that's going to be fine. That will get those sorted out. Almost done with these products. I am so excited about this. Look at these things. Wow. All the grills, all the kitchen multi-tools. Those look terrifying, to be honest. Those kitchen multi-tools, jeez. But this is going to be easily within our grasp. We are really doing well here. Nice. Okay, does this create any obstruction? Not really. These are clean pass-through corridors here, so we should be fine going from room to room. That's really nice. This room is nice the way we can add more machines here and not have any issue with that all right the question is should we wait for the next market cycle i don't know we could all right what else do we want to do we can probably take on the other robotics contract let's see create a plan for these did we do the mini bot before looks like we did yeah sure do it do some more more mini bots yay it is going to be really a long process to get these uh reps up high i think Wow. Oh, phone ringing. Hello. We just got the opportunity to collaborate with a famous furniture designer. We urgently need to create a set of prototypes for his uh, for her upcoming 
chair series. This is a relatively small order. We need it done ASAP. Okay, let's see. These are the fiery ones. Uh, let's see, create a plan. Let's see what we can do with this plan. Uh, what do we need here? We need five lightness. These have, let's see, 12 of this, 13 of that. So we probably need, go with this one. Okay, that's easier. Let's go with the four lightness here. Okay, and then I guess we need one lightness here. Uh, well, any of these will work. We do need one and one. Okay, so we can go for the cheapest or the easiest to make with this. Sure. Jigsaw cut. Okay, fine. Let's do this and can do these. Ooh, we do not have any metal bending. That could be a problem. Do we need to... Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Let's get that. All right, we do not have a metal bender. Let us put that in somewhere where I want to put it over here. Um, let's delete this area completely. Yes, go away. Move these or disassemble these. I'm going to disassemble these so I can move them faster and put those other things out here instead. All right, let's get the machinery. Metal bender. Yes, there we go. One and two. Good. Okay, and then we'll need the billboard for that as well. Let's see. Where is that? That's here. Put it here so it's easy for us to see. Order those. Get those already going. Okay. And I think we need to have some more decor in this room because I think it's straining. It is straining at the moment. Yes. There we go. 50. And arcade machine. Is that two wide or three wide? It is good enough. Good. Order. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is this one is going to, let's see, not there. We want to look at this and link to this billboard as well. Let's open, or not open, but oh, I was going to say open this up. Ish. Yes. Get that going there. Yeah, sure. Okay. And have a place to drop the items. Perfect. Can also make this a bit wider. I believe. Nice. Okay, good. We have the metal bending. So let's get that contract back up again. Create the plan and link this one to here. Uh, sure. Green. I was told I look very good in green today. So we'll go with green today. All right, let's get this assembly stuff sorted. Go here, please. Um... Yes, bandsaw cuts. There we go. Table saw. Yay. Sewing. Here. And the haulers are going to need to do a big job today, that's for sure. All over the place. Okay, let's execute this and to the top of the list. I forgot how much this is worth, actually. Hmm. Silly of me to forget or not look. That's okay, though. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, oh, oh. Truck arriving. Good, good, good. We finally are getting these things. Hopefully we'll get this stuff organized. Let's see if we can actually do this, because I feel like this is going to be a big ask. I don't know, because it takes so much time for stuff to arrive, and then stuff, and things, and we're kind of catching up a little bit, but not a lot. Hmm. I feel like I could use more people, too. Oh, no. Look at it. It's happening. It's actually getting there. Look at that. We are catching up. I hope we can get the whole thing sorted. We'll see. Now, the market. Did we pass the market cycle or not? Let's see. This one is... We have one more until this goes way up. So we'll, we'll wait uh, for the next one for that. Yay. Okay, almost there. Almost there. This is getting close. No! Faster, people! Faster! Do the thing! Did I click batch? 
Oh god, I think I didn't click batch. No. No, it's on the bike. I don't want the bike. I want the... The fancy chair. Is it this? No, that's not it. No, 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 no. What is it called? It's called designer chair. Let's find, see if it's in here. Is this... This is not organized in any way. By any, anything. No. Please, thing. Why? It's not alphabetically, it's not by when you last used it. Ah, uh, Your thing don't make me happy. No, no. Barbecue wagon, toy feed. All right, unless it doesn't store those one-time things, I don't know. Come on, people, no time for a coffee break. We need you to work right now. Get it done. Wow, we have some assembled already. That's good. We need these guys to be repaired. Come on. No! Wow, they're not getting it done. This is rough times. Dang it. Okay, so we're not that responsive here with our business. That ain't good. Oh, and someone said in the comments that the whole thing of like delaying the truck by one day, it has to do with these trucks. They come a day later, giving you extra time to finish. Okay. All right. We got something. Not enough, really. Oh, well. Sad times. Sad times. Oh, well. I guess we can... Can we delete this in any way? How do we delete the whole thing? Remove link tasks from workstations, but leave you with any leftover materials. Sure. No, I will, we'll finish it out, I guess. And we only had one left. All right. I just want to wait until the time it gets to 24 and those things are finished. Getting the robots done at least. That's good. Fix that, please. Oh my God. They're flying around! <gasps> oh, oh, that's so cool. Look at their, like, dragonfly bro bots. Oh, those are great. Look at them flutter. Oh my god, those are fantastic. <laughs> those are so funny. I like them. Okay, let's just... Sure, go away, go away. We don't want to be reminded of our failures, no. Dragonfly bots. Woohoo! Those are cool. What what was that ding? Hello? What is that ding sound? It must mean something. I'm sure it does. But I, I have no idea what. Maybe it was this? Was it the rankings? I don't know. You're really getting on my nerves now. Parasol was one of my largest subsidiaries. And you've outgrown them too? Prepare to die. I mean, shut down. Yeah, shut down. Maybe more appropriate. Mm hmm Yeah. So maybe it means we have one-upped our competitors nice okay i think um yeah oh wow we hit the new market cycle hey hey let's look at this let's see if we can do the thing here we go open market can we fulfill yes we have 40 we'll deliver these boom and these and this is the last thing we have 40 we should have sold some earlier i had forgotten how many we had i should i didn't look at this number but yeah we're gonna have to throw some out i think so this should mean that we have the thing done yes we do now we need to make more than 50 advanced products that is our next goal these are so cool these drones i love them they are really great Anyway, we're going to load in all of these terrifying looking kitchen multi-tools and, um, yeah, get those organized. Let's see. Six days left on these bots. That's amazing. That is a huge amount of time. I mean, this is not like the one day extra thing that we have to rely on. This is like massive amounts of days here. Pretty good. In any case, we're going to leave the next stuff for the next day. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.